Let me show you how to configure PowerShell to show the Git branch name at the end of the prompt, just like in the Git bash terminal. We need to do a couple of things. First, we need to install the posh git PowerShell module. Then we need to add this code block to our PowerShell profile. If you don't know where your PowerShell profile is, just type $profile. So in my case, it's called Microsoft.PowerShell underscore Profile.PS1 and is located in the Documents Windows PowerShell folder. But it's possible that both the folder and file don't exist by default. So first, we'll try to create the folder using the mkdir command. I got an error because the folder already exists. Now let's open the profile file in Notepad and add the configuration that will display the branch name in the PowerShell prompt. And there's one more thing. We need to make sure that the PowerShell execution policy allows running scripts. If it's restricted, the profile file won't be executed. What we can do is set the execution policy to either bypass or remote signed. Here I'll set it to remote signed. And that's all we need to do. Now let's restart the PowerShell console in our Git project. As you can see, the branch name is now displayed at the end of the PowerShell prompt.